This is Ian R. Crane on day 10 of the Orkham blockade and it's a Saturday, it's the second weekend but um, this is really the first opportunity we've had to see how many people were going to be prepared to make the effort to come down and show their support to the people at the Balkan blockade. We've had people from Blackpool, we've had people from Yorkshire, we've had people from all along the south coast and earlier this morning there was um, a walk down from the village some 200 of the villagers. Some of the villagers have shared with us that they are extremely upset that the media is trying to portray that the villagers are not supportive of the blockade here. What the villagers wanted to ensure that everybody here knew was that they are indeed supportive of what's occurring. They do not want Quadrilla or anyone else fracking in their backyard. The media, of course, during, the, during this week has done us a massive service with uh, Lord Howler uh, talking about uh, fracking the desolate northeast and then the desolate northwest, and Michael uh, uh, Fallon talking about uh, the people of the southeast having to get more support from the uh, the drive-throughs here. Yeah, we are we are on a semi-main road, but uh, fortunately everyone's um, uh, dropping their speed. So anyway, the, the reality is that the media are doing an outstanding job of helping us to raise awareness right across the country. The challenge now is to get more and more people from all walks of life, from right across the country, to come down to Borkham on a random basis, just come down for the day, get the train that gets down here at about 10.30, stay through till the early evening, you'll have an absolute blast. It's a carnival atmosphere, you're amongst like-minded people, it's building networks, this is what the establishment cannot handle. No hierarchy, just right-minded people who want to protect their environment and keep the water and the air and the soil safe for coming generations. So come on people, get your butt down to Balkan. Thanks very much. Ian Crane, Balkan, Saturday, 3rd of August.